Yo, yo, what's good, everyone? Welcome to my channel. I am a sage who rises today. I will be doing the sun, moon rising of Scorpio. So let's get to it. So, angels, what is the tea for Scorpio at this time? What is it that Scorpio needs to know? I hope you guys are having a wonderful day because I am. So let's get to it. So, angels, what's the tea? So we got don't want to hear it. So somebody don't want to hear it. What we got going on? We got I hate nothing about you. Watching shit go down. Enjoying the gossip. And then we have tired of drama. At the bottom of the deck we got a bugaboo here. So you got a bugaboo here? Mm. So let's see what's going on. So why is don't want to hear it? Why is this here? For Scorpio? Why is don't want to hear it? Yeah, three of pentacles in reverse. So, there could be a group of people that's falling apart, that was once working together, full card, because they're seeing that you're being set free, or that you're being, um, yeah, or that you were innocent. Yeah, devil. There's something toxic here. Two of cups. So, With the three of pentacles being in reverse, there's some type of collaboration falling apart. People are not seeing eye to eye with each other. They're turning on each other. Fool card. And this is because you're being seen as innocent. You're being set free, double, from some type of um, bondage, two of cups. Hmm. Ten of swords. So there's a couple here who possibly wanted to cause you a painful ending. They wanted to sabotage your happily ever after. Yeah, this couple. And they were obsessed. Okay? And they were careless. And now there's a group that's falling apart. Yeah, they don't want to hear it. Yeah, five of cups, somebody lost. They don't want to hear the fact that they lost. You got a queen of pentacles here. Three of wands. This person at a distance from you. This is a part of the trio. This person is two-faced as fuck. So, one of the people that was a part of the group is a queen of pentacles. Yeah, this could be somebody in a toxic relationship. That is going through a painful ending because they sabotaged their happiness. They missed the opportunity here. Yeah, somebody lost when they plotted against you to either end something for you just so that they could get victory and success with somebody that they were dating. Mm. Why is I hate nothing about you? Why is this here for Scorpio? Yeah, Hermit. So this could be a Virgo. Yeah, Chariot. So you could be um, isolating yourself, spending time to do introspection and solitude. You know, you're getting some type of spiritual enlightenment at this time. Chariot, which is allowing you to overcome an obstacle. Yeah, with the Knight of Pentacles, slow and steady ramp this race. You're practical, you're loyal, you're responsible, and you're persistent. Six of Cups and somebody from your past. This could be an ex. This could be an old friend. Ten of Wands is weighed the fuck down. Page of Pentacles, because this person came up with some type of plan against you, King of Swords, and you cut their ass off, Eight of Pentacles, and basically massage yourself, Three of Pentacles. So it's given like, there's a group of people that's falling apart because you massaged yourself and found out the truth about them planning against you. Now they're weighed the fuck down by what they did in the past, because they tried to slow up your process or slow up your path, and you still overcame the obstacle alone and in introspection. Yeah, with the fool, you're being set free. You're going on a whole brand new journey. You're taking a risk. I'm also hearing, make sure that you are, you know, making a choice before you take a leap of faith. Like, just don't jump into things. Make sure that you are choosing, you know, and then jump into it. Why is watching shit go down? Enjoying the gossip? Why is this here for Scorpio? Yeah, high priestess. So high priestess, you could be watching the shit show go down. Yeah, fool card. And it's because you know that you're not attached to it. <laughs> Ace of Cups, you are working on a new love in your life. Four of Swords, and you're taking a break here. Three of Swords, after somebody calls you heartbreak, a betrayal. Yeah. Some type of depression, unhappiness. Ace of Swords, that's the truth. Ace of Wands. So, somebody did candle magic here. With the Magician and the Ace of Wands. And that's the fucking truth. 
to cause you heartbreak, betrayal, loneliness, absent, division, depression, separation, unhappiness, turmoil, your grief, full of source, and you're being told to take a break from this person. Yeah, so that you can open up your heart. Okay? Because you are already free. You just need to trust in your spiritual insight, your esoteric um wisdom. Yeah, because you've already got victory and success, High Priestess. And now you're watching the shit show go down. Because <laughs> somebody was out here enjoying the gossip that was spread about you. Now you're watching the shit go down. Yeah, nine of swords. So somebody's tired of drama. This could be a Gemini. Mm -hmm. Ace of Pentacles. Somebody is in fear and anxiety when it comes to your financial new beginning. Because things is coming into fruition. You're healing. And you healing is causing somebody else some type of destruction. Chaos. Sudden upheaval. Sun card. That's a yes. Four of cups because they missed the opportunity. Ten of cups to have a happily ever after. The hangman. When they tried to sabotage you. Ten of swords and cause you a painful ending. Knowing that you were innocent. So somebody knew you were innocent. And they still tried to like curse you. Slander you. Or cause you a painful ending. Now they're stuck. Why you receive this happily ever after. Somebody is going through a tower because they missed the opportunity to heal. Now this person is being exposed for what they've been investing in. This is all because of some type of potential for abundance. Now somebody is going through some type of fear and anxiety. Yeah, temperance. They're going through fear and anxiety because things have been made balanced and fair for you. You can also have a harmonious relationship. You also got a bugaboo here. This burning evidence. This is fake friends here. So you got a bugaboo that's trying to burn evidence when it comes to this fake friend or these fake friends. Why is bugaboo here for Scorpio? Why is bugaboo here for Scorpio? This bugaboo could be a Pisces or a fucking Taurus. Yeah, this motherfucker was insecure. So they was out here creating illusions. King of Pentacles. Because they wanted to be seen as secure. Yeah. Somebody was doing magic. A Queen of Pentacles. So we got a King and a Queen of Pentacles here. And what's up motherfucking crazy is both of them is upright. Let me see something. Why is this King of Pentacles here? For Scorpio? Why is this King of Pentacles here? We got Mars retrograde. So this King of Pentacles is impulsive. And rage of anger, hostile, major blowouts, fights, and violence. Yeah. Why is this Queen of Pentacles here for Scorpio? I'm hearing this is the type of magic they was doing. Yeah. This Queen of Pentacles is a business rival. And they can't stay in your grind and your hustle. So they're summoning some shit. Mm. Why is the magician here for Scorpio? Yeah, somebody is doing work is, is doing work on a light worker. I'm saying that somebody is their own worst enemy. Tap in into your intuition because this is the key. Yeah, you are a light worker. And somebody is wearing a mask. Yeah. Somebody is doing some shit on moon cycles. And they're trying to wear a mask. You're being you're being told that you are a light worker. You can transmute this darkness into light. That's the key. Tap into your intuition. Okay? Yeah. And take a spiritual bath. So, yeah, this bugaboo is the king of pentacles and the queen of pentacles. What's so crazy about it is they could be up in life. This could be a Taurus and a motherfucking Virgo. They was out here creating illusions with manipulation. So, they was doing moon magic. Didn't I just say that? Moon cycles. They doing moon magic. This Taurus and this Virgo. Because they're a bunch of bugaboos. Again, you have to scrimp to adore this shit. You got a Pisces, a Virgo, who you cut the fuck off. And, you know, continue to work on yourself. Massage yourself. Hmm. Why is burning evidence here for Scorpio? Why is burning evidence? Yeah, double in reverse. So somebody is burning evidence. Mm hmm And it's because you release yourself with the double in reverse. Yeah, two of swords. Somebody is two-faced as fuck. Three of cups. This group of friends. 
Yeah, so you're being released. And somebody is an op. They're going to have to face their fears. This is somebody that's torn between two. And it's because they are they have divided loyalty. Yeah. You got a group of friends here that said that this is from you. Heartbroken. About somebody that you're dating. Yeah, your lover. You could be dating a cancer. And somebody could be wanting to slow this person up. This could be their ex. It's because they're weighed down by them ghosting them. Yeah, this King of Cups is ghosting motherfuckers. And it's weighing them the fuck down. This could be people they grew up with or their ex. And they call themselves trying to slow this person up. But um, they're overcoming obstacles. This lover of yours, whoever you're dating, somebody is heartbroken. This third party that's at a distance. Because they want to cause a truce here. Mm-hmm. What? Why is fake friends? Why is this here? Yeah, Will of Fortune. So this was destined to happen with these fake ass friends. Yeah, these fake ass friends was doing moon magic. And it's because you mastered yourself and found out the truth and cut their ass off. So yeah, they was out here doing moon magic. These fake friends. Hmm. What? <laughs> Don't nobody care. What we got going on for Scorpio? What's the tea for Scorpio at this time? What is it that Scorpio needs to know? Mm, that's a shame. Shadow work needs to be done. This came out again. Yeah, somebody want to call you, but they block. There's no more obstacles in your way. You could be dealing with a dark high priestess that would do anything for money and attention. I could be talking to a divine masculine. Yeah, there's an energy vampire here that will suck you dry, okay? They name can start with a P, Q, R, or S. This is a, a hoodoo or voodoo practicing mother or daughter duo. Yeah, this could be your in-laws. Some type of feud, unfair treatment will backfire because somebody is an envious sister or brother. Mm. An evil twin is what they said. Mm, excuse me. But yeah. <laughs> so let's get into it. Why shadow work needs to be done? Yeah, Queen of Swords. So shadow need shadow work needs to be done, okay? You're being told to be honest and truthful with yourself. Five of Cups, because you could be mourning, heartbroken, or there's some type of unwelcome change here. This could be to do with some type of inner child that you need to work on, empress. Yeah, you're showing up as the empress. A spiritual teacher, a leader. Hmm. Aquarius, Scorpio. So there's shadow work that needs to be done so that you can see something clearer. Because you could be grieving at this time. And this could be pertaining to a child. Yeah. You're definitely a mother. Hmm. Why is want to call you but blocked? Yeah, this couple. There's a couple that want to call you, but they're fucking blocked. Yeah, Chariot. You overcame some type of obstacle of them slowing up your finances. These are people of your fucking past that's weighed the fuck down. So somebody is way down. This is an ex of yours who thought they could slow you up for overcoming an obstacle in your partnership. Mm. Goofy. Why is Dark High Priestess here? We do anything for money and attention. Why is Dark High Priestess here? Yeah, Seven of Pentacles. This could be a Taurus. This is what they're investing in. Same card. And they're being exposed. Star card. Because you was able to heal four cups. And they missed the opportunity here. <laughs> tower. No, they're about to have a tower. Because you're letting go of people. Which is bringing in karma. Why is divine masculine here? Emperor. Important masculine. Energy. Boss. Big boss energy. Authority. Yeah. This divine masculine is this king of cups. So this could be you. Divine masculine. Seven of Cups. You have numerous options to choose from. Eight of Wands. And you will be gaining momentum. You just need to leave people out in the cold 
from your community so you can start fresh in a partnership. Why is the Eight of Wands here? Yeah, Tower. World. So somebody is shocked that you're gaining momentum over an illusion, King of Cups. <laughs> Again, somebody missed the opportunity because you was able to heal. So, of course, they're being exposed for what they've been invested in. This dark high priestess. I'm saying that somebody from your past has been trying to slow you up, okay, for overcoming obstacles and a partnership. This is somebody that wants to call you, but they know that they block. I'm also seeing that you're showing up as a mother. And you could have, you're showing up as an empress, but you could have um a child here that you lost. And you need to be truthful with yourself so you can do the shadow work. Shit, this could be you. You know you could have lost kids through CPS. Shit. It's okay. I mean, hey, shit happened. You know? But at the same time, it's an end to a cycle. Okay? Of, you know, motherfuckers attacking you. Because whatever the last attack that somebody did, they're getting karma for that. While you get victory and success and letting them go. Listening to your intuition. You know, you got major arcanas here. The Death card, the High Priestess, the Hierophant, the Two of Wands. It's like you transform. Now you're this independent, self-disciplined, you know, religious, educating type of person. It's like you have a coof about yourself now. Yeah. It's really giving like... There's an Empress here. This is definitely giving your energy... Or this could be somebody's baby mother, their ex. They missed the opportunity. Now they're going through a tower. But this could really be you. You could be this empress. And in the past, you could have missed the opportunity here. Which could have caused you some type of trauma. Okay. Loss. I'm seeing that you're being told to listen to your intuition. Because you could be slowly but surely healing. Which is allowing you to gain momentum. I'm saying that um, you could have lost something, but you're overcoming obstacles and something is being exposed, some type of illusion. Yeah, because you are emotionally intelligent and you're making some type of investment in a partnership. I also feel like you already know the truth about a lover. This is why you're investing in this person. Somebody else lost because you overcame an obstacle. Now they're being exposed for creating illusions. I'm saying that you listen to your intuition. And yes, you're slowly but surely healing, which is allowing you to gain momentum. There's also a mother figure here from your past, or this is the mother of your ex. This person missed the opportunity. So, of course, they have a tower that's coming towards them. <clears throat> or this could be um, your mother and, and an ex. Hey. But yeah, shadow work needs to be done. Okay? But it's cool. I mean, hey. You're going to be fine. What we got going on for school? It says vegan. Think that they're better than you. It says want to get clout and famous off your downfall and setback. Want to be the reason you fell off. <laughs> we got hood bully. And two you speak up for yourself, actor, at its finest. And then we got hate. Somebody hate the way that somebody loves you. They hate the love that you receive from others. They want to discredit you, but it's all in their head. Yeah. This is somebody who not who they appear to be. They're really crushing on you. So somebody could be crushing on you. And somebody feel as though you know too much. So they wanted to get you out the way. <laughs> this is giving like somebody want to get you out the way, but they fuck with you. It's like they fuck with you, but you know too much. So they want to get you out the way. It's really giving delusional. Why is vegan? I mean, why is vegan here? They know they're better than you because they're vegan. Yeah. This could be an in-law. Okay, King of Wands and Aries, Leo, Sag. Yeah, this could be a Pisces, Aries, or Sag. That's the fucking truth. You've already let go of this motherfucker. And it's because they only worried about the fucking money. 
They thought they was going to see some good news in the family dynamic. But this family, definitely the three people that collaborate with each other, they're falling apart. Because they siphon something from your energy. To move on to calmer waters. This is the path they chose. Yeah, look at this shit. So somebody chose, or you could have chose to move on to calmer waters. Now you're getting what you deserve. And there's a group of people falling apart. They turn on each other. And it's family dynamic. And it's because you're receiving good news. You have a financial new beginning, a new job, a new business, money, investments. And um, you're letting go of people. That's the truth. So that you can alchemize, get energy, you know. Basically have balance and peace in your life. King of Wands, you're stepping up to lead. Ten of Cups. And you're going to have a happily ever after. Mm -hmm. Who is this vegan person? This is somebody that's two-faced, that's insecure, and now they're in regret. Why is want to get famous and clout off of your downfall and setback? Yeah, somebody thought that they was going to gain some type of momentum here. This person is about to have a tower. <laughs> this couple who took this hasty decision towards you, Queen of Cups, and it's all because they're corrupt tyrant type of behavior yeah they're way down now these third parties because you welcome in love in your life and now they're about to be left out in the cold for attacking you because it's an end to this cycle you are slowly but surely overcoming obstacles in a partnership by listening to your intuition it's like yes you could be at you could be a little bit sad but only thing you got to do is be truthful with yourself which is going to expose something yeah it's the end of a cycle. A motherfucker charging towards you because of the unconditional love that somebody had for you. Motherf motherfuckers feel left out in the cold, okay? Or motherfuckers wanted you to feel left out in the cold and they were celebrating. Now they weighed the fuck down because they lack control. But true Queen of Cups, you remained, you know, an emotional, mature woman, secure, loving, warm, faithful, loyal to your lover. And somebody took an impulsive ass action that is now causing them a tower because you're gaining momentum. Hey, why is hood bully until you speak up for yourself, actor at its finest? Why is this here for Scorpio? This is either a cancer or a Virgo. Yeah, you're winning. You're overcoming obstacles. You're successful. And it's because of your ambition and determination. Yeah, Knight of Pentacles. You're practical. You're loyal. You're responsible. And with the Ace of Pentacles, you have a financial new beginning. Page of Wands, this is good news for you. Ten of Pentacles, because you could be accumulating some type of um unexpected financial income, lump sum, three of Pentacles in reverse, and you're not working with these people. Six of Pentacles, and it's because you're giving them what they gave you. Six of Swords, you're moving on to common waters, and this is the path you chose, and that's the truth. So you cutting off motherfuckers is allowing you to have some type of breakthrough. It's giving you some type of clarity and truth about the path that motherfuckers chose. And now you're moving to common waters, getting equal give and take. And there's a group that's falling apart within a family dynamic because you're receiving good news and you have some type of potential for abundance. And it's because you was practical and loyal and you're winning and overcoming obstacles. And you got a hood bully here that's just slow as fuck. Like, <laughs> hood bully? Come on now. Why is hate the love you receive from others? Want to discredit you, but it's all in their head. Why is this here, Scorpio? Yeah, six of wands. You're getting public recognition. You got success, victory. You're winning. You're having the advantage. Page of cups. Yep. This is joyful news. Two of swords. Because somebody was two-faced. Somebody felt torn in between two. Three of wands. This is somebody in the distance from you. Three of swords that's heartbroken as fuck. Page nine of cups because they want to date you. So you got a Pisces, Libra, Aries... Um, Leo. Yeah, somebody came up with a fucking plan here to create an illusion because you was being seen as such sufficient independent and you were accomplishing your dreams. Yeah, somebody from your past. This could be a Taurus. Yeah, somebody, somebody did not know that you had the strength to overcome toxic energy and balance out something. Somebody caused conflict amongst a group of people. So, yeah, somebody called conflict amongst a group of people in a community because they wanted to be seen as innocent. Yeah, but you are a high priestess. You already transformed. Now somebody is going through some type of obstacle for some hasty decision they made. This is a couple here. 
queen of cups they tried to block you they wanted you to be powerless mentally stuck in trap going through fear and anxiety that's the truth this is the work that they did to cause you a painful ending you were supposed to be having um you were supposed to be going through a painful ending and fear and anxiety again somebody that you're dating or somebody wants to date you and they're heartbroken at a distance from you because they was two-faced and this is somebody that was crushing on you and now they're saying that you're getting some type of recognition some type of success in the spotlight mm -hmm. and they hate the love that you receive from others why is not who they appear to be really crushing on you what i just said that yes somebody seven of swords somebody is lying here somebody is lying to you okay they're lying Queen of Swords, that's the truth. Sun card, that's a yes. Seven of Pentacles, somebody was was investing in a third party here. <laughs> the Lord. So somebody was lying here, okay? And you could have set clear-cut boundaries because they got exposed. Or something was exposed to you. Or you went to go look for some type of truth and it was exposed that this person was invested in a third party. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. Somebody wants to charge towards you and offer you their cup of love. And it's because they feel left out in the cold. Yeah. <laughs> They're also a king, a queen of wands, Aries, Leo, Sag. This person is about to be going through poverty. Because you're about to have a new beginning. And it's because you see some type of opportunity. And there's a group of bitches here who plotted on you that's being exposed. You could have already communicated this truth about somebody being a liar, a cheater. Yeah, somebody was obsessed with lying. And it's because you mastered yourself. I'm saying that you was able to heal and block this motherfucker and release them. With that four pinnacles in the verse, you release their ass. So... It don't even really matter now. It really don't matter. Like, but you're set free. Do you, babe? Do you? I feel you, though, Scorpio. Because I wouldn't be fucking with nobody like that either. So, angels, what we got going on for Scorpio? What's the tea for Scorpio? Yeah, King of Cups. So, you're showing up as emotionally mature. Yeah, page of swords and somebody is watching you or you can have a king of cups this person can have glasses they're definitely watching you and they're wanting to have a brand new beginning with you yeah nine of swords this person has came out of their head this is somebody who could have possibly been scared yeah confirmation yeah ten of cups somebody sees you as they have to rather they're lying this is somebody who calls you a painful ending and it's by cutting you off. So somebody could have broke up with you. Yeah, that's the truth. Because of a queen of wands. Aries, Leo, Sag. Yeah, this person. Lord. Why is this king of cups here? For Scorpio? Why is this king of cups here? Yeah, ten of pentacles. So this king of cups. Is a part of your legacy? Or this king of cups could be in your family? Or King of Cups, this could be your family. Moon card. <laughs> that's insecure. Creating illusions out of fear and anxiety. Ten of Swords. Yeah, they're about to go through a painful ending. Hermit. For trying to cloak themselves. Five of Swords. Yeah, motherfuckers was playing mind games. They had the nerve to try to cloak themselves. Like they wasn't the ones behind this betrayal. Behind this breakup. Moon card. They was trying to create an illusion. Ten of Pentacles, this family. Why is the Page of Swords here? For Scorpio, why is the Page of Swords here? Somebody is watching you. Ace of Cups. So somebody is watching this new beginning you have with somebody. Yeah, Ten of Swords. And they are heartbroken here. <laughs> Seven of Swords because they was out here lying. Nine of Cups about, you know, being accomplished. I'm also seeing that somebody tried to, like, cloak the fact that you was their wish fulfillment. Somebody lied, and they ready to cause you pain. Then to the moon card, be like somebody creating. A, what's so fucking crazy is this? With this page of cups, somebody is crushing on you, bro. They're obsessed. Like they're obsessed 
with you. Like, this is a crush that's obsessed with you. But they tried to keep this a secret with the hermit. Nine of cups that you were their wish fulfillment. Seven of swords, they're, they lied to you. Ten of swords caused you a painful ending. Moon card, because they was in fear and anxiety. Ten of swords, so they rather you be broken up with, going through, you know, a betrayal. Ace of cups, then to offer you their cup of love. Ten of cups, this is somebody's family. Page of swords watching you. This is a king of cups. So a king of cups is curious. This could be a family member. Or this could be the family of somebody that you are in a uh, relationship with. There was so much in fear and anxiety that they wanted to create a fucking illusion here. To the point that it will cause you a painful ending. Like bro, this betrayal was because of lies. And somebody is trying to cloak their selfishness. Why is the fool here? Well, you're being set free. You're going on a whole brand new journey. You're being seen as a trendsetter. You're just needing to, like, choose, though, okay? Yeah, nine of pentacles. You're on a whole brand new path. You're set free. You're showing up as single, so sufficient and independent. Yeah, but the four of cups, somebody missed the opportunity here. Five of pentacles. You got your own stuff out of the cold. You got your own stuff out of poverty. Justice. And the scales are being made bonus for you. But like I said, somebody definitely wants to date you. They're wanting to communicate with you. You're being told to listen to your intuition. And walk away. Because this is somebody who was plotting. A king of wands. Yeah. Yeah. But somebody do want to date you though. They could be wanting to like email you. Send you text messages. Send you DMs. But you're being told to listen to your spiritual knowledge. Yeah. This is somebody who could have walked away from you. And now they want to invest in you. This is a king of wands. Aries Leo Sag. They're seeing that you message yourself and that you transform into this emperor energy. Yeah. Hmm. There's a couple here that's two-faced and they sabotage themselves for creating an illusion just to get victory and success in their partnership. Whatever little conflict they cause, it's the end of that cycle. Then you got a queen of wands and the king of swords and the queen of swords. These third parties, they were celebrating. You know, alchemizing some type of energy for a mother figure. They came up with this plan to cause you sadness and a heavy burden. Thinking they was going to get good news from the devil. Yeah, their pants has been slowed up and everything is chaotic now. Because they took an impulsive ass action and they're under judgment. Because you had to scrim to lay some shit to rest here. Hmm. Well. Why is the nine of swords in the reverse? You overcame some type of dark night of the soul. You found light at the end of the corner. Yeah, queen of cups, this is you yeah you could be nurturing your relationship at this time okay and somebody is two-faced it here yeah so you're being told yeah five of cups so basically somebody could be crushing on you but they're way down sad crying of a spilled milk because they came up with some type of plan here with a mother and you persevered some type of attack here and blocked it <laughs> well well what was supposed to happen? You thought somebody, you thought we were just gonna let you attack us or some shit? Yeah, somebody thought they was cloaking themselves. This is somebody that could be an alcoholic. This could be a Virgo or Pisces, a Libra or Pisces. Yeah, somebody sabotaged themselves, and that's karma for what they wish. They thought they cloaked themselves. This is somebody who caused you a painful ending with lies, and now that you're coming out of the cold, this is somebody who wants to cause truce now. They're two-faced as fuck, though. This is a couple who you're already skeptical about. They caused you a painful ender out of fear and anxiety. Yeah, there's also a family who wants to show you love now because you're showing up as such sufficient independent Queen of Cups. Yeah, we got the Queen of Cups and the King of Cups. Somebody is watching y'all go through this brand new path, a new journey, and setting yourself free. So you could be in a relationship with a water sign just like yourself. Mm-hmm. You could be in a relationship with a water sign. Oh, I could talk. I could be talking to my feminines and my masculines here. Y'all got motherfuckers watching y'all on y'all new path. Because you overcame some type of dark night of the soul. There's also a family here that's going through fear and anxiety because they caused you a painful ending and they thought they cloaked themselves. Whatever they wished for was, you know, they wished to basically become enemies. Okay, but try to disguise their stuff as your friend so they could cause you a painful ending. 
and um somebody still has unconditional love for you yeah somebody is curious to why they're getting karma and how you was able to come out of poverty it's because they missed the opportunity they got rejected that's why <laughs> the fuck <laughs> what, what do you mean seven of cups at the bottom of the deck somebody was wishfully thinking yeah this little trio this little group of bitches that was working with each other they sabotage themselves they're stuck they gotta let go what we got going on let's go for y'all what's the tea the tea is the six of swords the tea is you're moving to common waters <laughs> you're healing yeah the world card as you move to common waters the cycle is closed Five of Wands with this group of people keep trying to compete with you. Yeah, Nine of Wands because you've already persevered. So with giving, you've already persevered some type of conflict, some type of battle, some type of competition. It's like you've already moved on. It's the end of a cycle of somebody competing with you. You've already persevered. Okay? It's just that simple. Why is the Six of Swords here? Yeah, somebody sabotaged themselves. Like I said, yeah. So because you have this happily ever after, somebody was out here doing magic, a king of pentacles is at a distance from you. <laughs> this is somebody that's stuck now. It doesn't even matter what the fuck they did. They're stuck with the hangman. Why well, is the six of swords here? Yeah, three of wands. You're moving to calmer waters. Three of wands, which is allowing you to have a bright future. Yeah, two of wands, you plan. That's crazy. You plan. And then you have a bright future as you move to common waters. Yeah, you're this badass being full of life, love, and possibilities. And somebody else is going through a fucking tower for playing mind games. When it came to like a connection you're in. Yeah, this queen of wands and their partner was out here playing mind games. Now they're about to go through a fucking tower. Because you are this badass being full of life, love, and possibilities. And that's the fucking truth. <laughs> this could be an Aries. What we got going on? Why is this two of wands here? Yeah, through a swords. So somebody is heartbroken on the path they chose. Is it somebody that this is from you who you're moving the fuck away from? Why is the world here? For Scorpio? Yeah, there's an end to a cycle. You're in a new relationship and somebody is curious to why you are, you know, in hiding. It's because they caused you a painful ending over an illusion, knowing that you were self-sufficient and independent, but you know why I don't fuck with you. What the hell? Yeah, you've came out of poverty and somebody else is in balance. Point blank period. Why is the world here for Scorpio? Why is the world here? Yeah, eight of swords in reverse. You closed out a cycle and set yourself free. You was able to escape. Six of cups. Yeah, somebody from your past is mourning you. Somebody is crying. Well, somebody's going to be heartbroken, they're going to be mourning for what they did in the past. Yeah, somebody's going to be mourning. With the Three of Swords and the Five of Cups, they're going to be mourning. Because whatever path that they chose in the past, you're being set free. And it's coming towards them because it's an end to the cycle. And you've already moved the fuck on. Well, that's the Five of Wands here. Yeah. Motherfuckers wanted to compete with you because you was, you know, getting attention. You was, you know, victorious, successful, ten of pentacles. So somebody tried to compete with you because you got victory and success over this family. Yeah, a family tried to basically control the situation here. Yeah, they tried to slow up your finances. These motherfuckers was wishfully thinking. Now they're weighed the fuck down here. Yeah, this community and this mother. So there is a mother and the king of pentacles here that's going to have to lay some shit to rest with working with these people. Or with working in a group. I don't know. Why? Or working together as a team. Why is the nine of wands here? Because you persevered. Like, you persevered. Yeah. You persevered. Justice. And now you're and now there's about to be consequences. Two of cups for this couple. Mainly this King of Wands. Yep, this King of Wands, whoever they're in the partnership is about to get karma because you persevered. Yep. I'm saying that you moved to common waters, close out the karmic cycle because somebody was in competition with you. Yeah, trying to cause you an ongoing battle and you persevered every time. Again. Oh. Again, somebody at a distance from you. You've released yourself from this person, which allowed you to get victory and success, and now they're getting karma. 
Because of the path they chose in the past, his family, they partner up with each other to cause you heartbreak. Now they're going to be sorry. Because they was holding on to, to, to some deep rooted past issue because of a king of wands. Yeah, this king of wands thought they could hold you back. Now they're crying over spilled milk, heartbroken. Because you're in a partnership where you're accumulating some type of inheritance. Yeah, this is an ex of yours. They chose to, what, send shit towards you and you was able to get yourself out of it. So, yeah, you're getting victory and success. And they're getting karma. As you move to karma order, it's a closing of this cycle. Yeah, somebody's competing with you. So the cycle is closed with these bitches that's been competing with you because you already persevered. Page of Wands, and that's good news for you. <laughs> You're on your new journey, point blank, period. It's like motherfuckers just need to get that part. Like, what the fuck is you doing? Like, bro, I'm on a new journey. If yeah, somebody is watching you, heartbroken, bro. Fuck is you watching me, heartbroken, bro? So <laughs> when you could be watching yourself. I don't know. Me, I'm different. I really don't have time for that dumb ass shit. When it's over, it's over. Move on with your life, you know? Because if it was us, if we was going after a nigga who didn't want us, they're going to be looking at us like we crazy. Yeah, somebody is trapped in that little magic they did. Yeah, sure is. Yeah, somebody thought they was going to receive good news. Or oh, this is good news for you. Yeah, this is good news for you. Or somebody thought it was some get good news, getting some type of support. But this is a live and learn situation because somebody was in an illusion. Yeah, you got three bitches here that is enlightened. Well, there's three bitches that you've been enlightened about that's been trying to what? Put some type of unwanted attention on you. And it's because they wanted to bind your gift. Yeah, they wanted your gift to come to an end. And it's because of an online community. It's causing them some type of darkness to suffering. Girl, don't nobody give a fuck about that. Let's see what's going on. Why is good news here? Let's go here. Yeah, page of wands in reverse. So your good news is bad news for someone else. They're going through some type of dark night of the soul. Feeling way the fuck down. Because they see some type of opportunity. Now they're getting karma. This is somebody that's watching you. Yeah, this little group of bitches that fell apart. You also got a queen of pentacles here. This bitch is insecure. That's why they stuck now and heartbroken. And it's because of what they did in the past. Why is care here? Yeah, somebody got support in the past. That's the truth. To play these mind games with you. Motherfuckers was two-faced because of what you did for work and because of this happily ever after that you had. So they tried to end it for you, but you still was able to persevere. You're being told to block motherfuckers because they feel as though you don't deserve what it is that you had. So they're taking action towards your wish fulfillment. So you're being told to block these people. Point blank, period. Ain't no being nice with a bitch no more. Block them. Why is live and learn here? Yeah, this was supposed to give you experience. Yeah, death card, seven of wands, ace of wands. You transform. <laughs> and now it's time for you to protect yourself against whatever actions that motherfuckers is trying to take. Yeah, there's a family here that's in competition with you. And they're holding on to some deep rooted past issue here. They think that they God. I keep saying, motherfuckers think that they God, like for real. Why is Daydream here? For Scorpio? Yeah, somebody was optimistic about an illusion. This is somebody who was daydreaming. Yeah, nine of swords. Now this person is going through some type of dark night of the soul. Because you've already messaged yourself. And this is somebody who was two-faced. Trying to bully you. Trying to intimidate you. And that's why you cut their ass off. Yeah, because somebody was passionate. About being toxic, about causing you heartbreak, and about sabotaging you. There's a toxic ass couple that's heartbroken that they sabotage themselves. Because something was just a fucking illusion. Why is these three bitches here? Why is indulgence here? Yeah, King of Cups. These are third parties to a King of Cups. Yeah, that's the truth. These bitches are about to be going through poverty, adversities, fit enough out in the cold. Because this King of Cups is skeptical about them. Yeah, somebody is a liar. And they're about to be exposed. This whole community. And they're going to be in hell of regret. Why is blessing here? Fulfillment, well-being, enlightenment. Yeah. 
So you was already enlightened by a queen of wands. This person wanted to reconcile with somebody you're dating. Now this bitch is going through a tower for this root, this little root work they was doing. It's somebody who thought they was going to get some type of um, good news with doing root work because they was crushing on somebody. Like, bitch, it doesn't, bitch, what? Yeah, you was able to heal. And now you got financial new beginning. You got love. And you're being told to listen to your intuition about the King of Pentacles because they caught yourself trying to attack you here because they're weighed the fuck down. This... <laughs> You ain't got time for this, okay? Why is protest here? Yeah. You had a group of people or two people here trying to protest you. Yeah, they was trying to hold you back. They thought that holding you back was going to bring them in good news. Yeah, motherfuckers, this is a competition with you. A fucking family. So they're taking action here to try to block something from you. For trying to end something for you. And it's because they want to slope your path. You're being told to walk away from these people. Definitely this king of wands. Because they're mentally stuck and trapped. Because you've already overcame an obstacle from this little trio of bitches when you ghosted them. And stood in your power. To, like, what are we talking about? <laughs> Why is commitment here? Yeah, you know, somebody tried to bind you. Yeah, look. Somebody tried to bind you because you were self-sufficient, so independent. And you was moving to common waters. So they chose this path. To come up with a plan against you. Yeah. They thought it was God. They thought it could cause you painful endings. And lay shit to rest for you. Mm -mm -mm. Yeah this queen of wands. This Aries Leo says. This bitch is going to be more mean. This community. Because she's going to be exposed. For being a fucking liar. And she's going to be in hell of regret. Because she's going to be left out in the cold. From you queen of cups. Because you got success. Coming towards you. And you got an ex here that sees you as they wish fulfillment. And um, you will be persevering. So, yeah, King of Pentacles. Yeah, there's a Taurus Vera Capricorn who you could be standing your ground against. But yeah, um, motherfucker's weird. And this can all be because you're gifted. Like you could be a, you could be gifted, and motherfuckers ain't like that. Oh fucking well though. Like what? Anybody got time for that dumbass shit? Like. What, what 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 are you talking about? <laughs> like, why are you worried about if I'm gifted or not? Yeah, somebody is stressed the fuck out. These friends, because they're sick. Whatever they planned, they was responsible for it. Now they're being held back and feeling lonely while you be supported. Yeah, somebody is stressed out because these group of friends, yeah. These group of friends is sick as fuck. Well, so they sick as fuck for whatever they planned. They are responsible for... You know, trying to collect shit off your loneliness. They they thought they was going to be able to collect some shit off you being lonely. That shit crazy. Yeah. They lost for pretending. Now they want to apologize because they're being rejected in their partnerships. This family who wanted to be a third world enemy is powerless and cursed. Yeah. For whatever they arranged. Now they're paranoid and scared. Oh, fucking well, bitch. Like, what are we talking about? Oh, fucking well.